Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to our one, two, three, play with me virtually. And today we're going to focus on block play and transportation toys. So first, let's start with blocks. So we have a variety of blocks here. We have your traditional geometric shapes. We have these double and single so that you can build into towers weird shapes and configurations and then we have just the plain old cubes that everybody loves to just stack as high as they can until they fall over so when children play with the blocks when they stack them dump them or knock them over that's how they learn some simple math and science skills like with these they learn about the geometric shapes like we have a pyramid a cylinder we have a cube. You can also fine it down to triangle, square, rectangle, and circle. They playing with blocks also helps them learn about weights and measures. Like the more you pile onto something, the heavier it's gonna be until it gets too heavy it might topple over um, they'll also learn about height how high can you build it before it topples over i think this might do it oh no <laughs> it's gonna stay and when they build towers like this that helps them learn a, you know keeps emphasizing the use of the fine motor skills and then also how to balance the blocks when they balance the blocks it teaches them how to problem solve like we've got our pyramid on top and say we wanted to add one more and we add it, it's not gonna stay. How can we fix that problem? Well, the kids might just figure out if you swap them. There you go, we have our tower. And when kids build together, that's how they learn how to cooperate taking turns and sharing, patience, and persistence. Now, with these, we're gonna go back to those math and science skills. These are really great because they can also help develop patterns. You can play pattern games, like what color comes next? Or you can do counting we have how many green blocks you can count one two three you can even do some simple addition and subtraction like if we have three green blocks we add one two blue blocks how many blocks do we have and then if we take away we have five blocks we're going to take away the two blue blocks now how many do we have and very very simple and fun games for the kids to play and now with transportation toys, we have things like trains and train tracks. We have our helicopter and airplane, the fire truck. We have construction trucks. We have any kind of vehicle that goes, kids love to play with. And when they play with these, that also helps emphasize those fine motor skills because you have to pick up and grab, you push. Like with, the, with our fire truck here, you know it's manipulating and moving the parts of it same thing with the airplane they can spin the wheels spin the propeller all of that focusing on those fine motor skills development now when they pretend to fly and drive the vehicles that helps them work on using their imagination they can create their roads and their towns to express their creativity and it also helps to problem solve and you can combine the two blocks and transportation toys and use some of the blocks to make a town and then oh no let's pretend the house is on fire here comes the fire truck to save the day so it incorporates all of those skills together same thing with the train table so they use their creativity and imagination to design their track set up and then using those fine motor skills they drive their trains along the tracks 
it also helps with the problem solving because you know oh my train's not sticking maybe if we flip it now it works <laughs> and we have our construction trucks here we have the rug that has the construction playground on it but if you don't have something like this it's really simple just go outside and use your construction trucks dig in the dirt pour it in the dump truck and you can dump it out lots of fun and easy ways to do it you can even take sidewalk chalk and draw your own roads and construction areas your own train tracks in the driveway and use your toys out there and outside and have lots of fun so I hope you enjoyed learning about our how to block play and transportation toys and have fun playing we'll see you next time